Next question, question 20. There are 13 two digit consecutive odd numbers. If 39 is the mean of the first five such numbers, then what is the mean of all the 13 numbers? So, it is said there are 13 numbers and it is two digit numbers and consecutive odd numbers. So, this is the information given. Uh, so, in such questions, in wh whether the numbers are con con consecutive, um, following some um, pattern, uh, it is always good if we construct numbers like this. So, we will first assume the middle numbers as x. So, since it is consecutive odd numbers, if the middle number is x, what will be the next um, uh, odd number? It will be x plus 2. And what is the number, what is the odd number that is behind this x? It will be x minus 2. Similarly, if we construct uh, the all the numbers, then finding mean will be very easy. So, here we know that there are 13 numbers. So, this is the middle number and there are 6 numbers to its right and 6 numbers to its left. So, 6 plus 6, 12 and the middle number 13. So, total 13 numbers. So, x, x plus 2. We will write all the numbers x plus 4, x plus 6, x plus 8, x plus 10 and x plus 12, 6 numbers and similarly 6 numbers to its left x minus 4, x minus 6, x minus 8, x minus 10, x minus 12. So we have constructed all, wrote down all the numbers. Now, what is given? If 39 is the mean of the first five such numbers. So, this is the first number. And if you can see the first five number is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, these are the first five numbers. So, what will be the mean of first five numbers? Mean, since these are consecutive numbers, uh, which are equally spaced, we, this mean is simply the middle number. Since it is odd number of numbers, mean will be simply the middle number, this number, right? If it was even number of numbers, it would uh, we should add all the numbers and divide by the number of numbers. Now, it is not necessary here. Uh, even if we add x minus 12, x minus 10, plus x minus 8, plus x minus 6, plus x minus 4 by 5, we will still get x minus 8 as our answer. So, here it is very simple. Uh, the middle number will be the mean of the first five numbers. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and middle number is x minus 8. So, it is given x minus 8 is 39. So, x is 47. Now, the question asks, what is the mean of all the 30 numbers? What will be the mean of all the 30 numbers in consecutive numbers? It will be the middle number. Since we constructed with x as the middle number, so, the mean of all these 30 numbers will be x itself, which is 47. We already found out. That is the, so we didn't have to do any kind of summation or division or anything. We can straightforwardly find, find out the answer if we know this method. So, that is one advantage of this method. So, solution is x is equal to 47. So, solution to question 20 is a 47.